Yeah, I started at Webco in 1976. And, um, in the early days, it kind of reminds me of when I was a kid. I watched uh, the man land on the moon. Uh, I saw him interview Neil Armstrong one time about that many years later. And this interviewer said, Mr. Armstrong, you were on the moon. You had the lunar uh, rover there to get back up to your ship. What would you have done if the rockets hadn't have fired on that ship? You know, what, uh, what you were thinking about all of mankind and the accomplishments or, and see, and he said, no ma'am. He said, I'd have been trying to get them rockets to fire. And so that's how I think about the early days of Webco. We didn't think about much longer than tomorrow. We were in survival mode and everything that we did was about surviving till tomorrow. But through the years, we got stronger. We diversified our company. We got into multiple markets, many different markets, grew people, grew talent, uh, grew the whole organization to the point where we could truly think about our purpose being a forever company. And the main thing about being a forever company, Simon Sinek sums, sums it up in one of his books called The Infinite Game. In the beginning, you can't think about the infinite game. You just got to think about surviving and getting to tomorrow. And that's what we did. But now we can truly think about the infinite game with our suppliers, with our customers, but most importantly with our people, that we can truly invest in them forever, try to help them become all they're capable of becoming.